What's up everybody? It's VR Gamer Dude here, and today we have become one of those damn dirty apes. That's right. So today we're going to be taking our first look at Crisis on the Planet of the Apes VR, and man, let me tell you, this game is freaking nuts. So in the game, we're an ape, we've been captured by the humans, and we've got to find a way to escape and get back to Caesar. So, all right, let's mount up, let's get in there, and let's take a look at Crisis on the Planet of the Apes. I got a bag on my head. Dark Sun Warpath. Whoa. No kidding. We've been out here 18 months. They want to shoot something. Get moving. Uh, okay, bro. Oh shit! Never mind. This one looks dumb. I'm going. Looks like you got a smart move, ape. Fucking waste. Okay, so I've already done the tutorial, and the only smart. thing I can say that I don't like so far, I, I do like the movement, I like the arm swinging, but I don't like having to wait for the silhouette of the ape to appear before I can move. But I guess it keeps the timing going in the cinematicness of the game. Okay, I, I'm going. I love my hairy ape arms here too. That is just really cool. You can totally tell this is done in Unreal Engine. Well, you look promising. Dr. Devin, this one checks out. Looks like the military did their job after all. Yeah, took them long enough. Place them with the advanced specimens. Sweet, I'm an advanced specimen. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, hey, bro. Okay. Just like the other um, no. Give me your hand. Um, do I have to? Oh, oh. I got branded. I kind of saw that coming, but still. Uh. This is one dumbass ape. Oh yeah, who's talking, buddy? This one's stubborn as hell. would like me to issue a reminder. Keep your face mask on at all times. Oh cool, you can do it one-handed too. Man, the environment in here is freaking great. God, everything looks so clean. Except for this guy, he's like really short from the waist down and really big from the waist up. But you know what? I'm gonna give him a pass because Jesus, this looks incredible. I'll tell you what, the sound effects, everything. I mean, th th this is like so damn immersive. Okay, I'm stopping now. I don't want to trouble. Animations are freaking nuts. I 
I mean, you know, normally when you think a movie kind of tie-in or, you know, something based on a movie franchise, it's going to kind of suck. But I'm telling you what, Fox has outdone themselves. Night, night. That's not cool, man. You're Devons now, but soon you'll be mine. And I cannot wait to put a bullet whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, bro. Oh. Reminder to all personnel. Acquiring property from deceased persons or abandoned structures is strictly prohibited. Escape. Yeah. Me escape. Okay, you beat my chest. Damn, it's probably that new one. One thirty nine. Wait here. I'll check on them. All right, all right, everybody, shut up. You just fucking love those train darts, don't you, Carl? Yeah, get him. the hair on the apes the eyes oh my man I know I'm just going blah 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 but this is freaking nuts okay follow you Love the climbing in here. Okay, I'm going down. Reminder. Now, I don't like the vignette though. I really wish there was a way to turn that off. But it really only happens when you fall, so... Hey, what are you doing? My brother's down there. Sound effects are good. Forget about it. Let's just get this done. Forget about it. Sure, but the apes are a lot smarter up here. Stop for a minute and just watch this go down. Let's wrap up and call it. It's like 3 a.m. or something. All right, let's get on with it. Ha, ha, ha. 
I'm coming, bro. Okay. Now, you definitely, uh, stop here for a minute. You, you do have the arm swing locomotion, but you, I mean, you can kind of room scale it a little bit. So, I mean, I can walk around if I want to. I can peek around corners, uh, but primarily the game is set for you to just kind of stand in one place and turn here. So, just thought I'd mention that. But see, like right there, I kind of need to get a little closer to the ladder because I probably got off of my mark. Okay, coming. See, you see. Keeps coming up empty. Yeah, the man wants to pull the plug. Oh, like those guys wouldn't have heard that door slam like that. Ready? Punch him. All right. Ooh, clocked you in your head, son. Okay, cover tutorial. Grab the grip to cover. <laughs> the comically big touch controllers are just cracking me up. Oh, and they need to put some colliders. I'm going to say that because you can get your head too far into a wall and it just blacks out. Vital's good, as always. And the new report? <sighs> Nothing. As always, we test again tonight. Stop! No more! <sighs> I can't. 109. I know. We can find a cure. I don't know how much more time they're gonna give me. Dr. Devin. Hey. Please report to command center. Repeat. Rest. Dr. Devin to command center. I'll try again tomorrow. here so yeah as I mentioned earlier the sometimes getting your head out of the uh, walls here is a little immersion breaking well I mean a lot of immersion breaking but you know like I said I'm gonna give them some passes just for the sheer cinematicness of this this is just freaking great I know I'm fanboying all over the place, but I love the Planet of the Apes movies, man. I grew up in the 70s and, and watching the original Planet of the Apes and then the new ones, uh, they've just been really decent. So having this as a, a cinematic VR experience is just awesome. All right, I'm going, bro. I, got, I need to talk to these people for a second. Oh. Yes, got a gun. Okay. Holster on the back. All right. And pull it back out. Nice. Return home, back to Caesar. And I think it's interesting how, just like in the movie, sometimes they talk, sometimes they use sign language. Oh, hey, sorry, bro. I need to shoot off my gun here. Sweep the slaughterhouse and find Devin, and and remind her to send transfer orders through the proper channels. Okay, cover tutorial. Oh. 
Am I gonna shoot something now? Oh, butters, you do not shoot a guy in the dick. <laughs> oh, headshot. Oh, that was satisfying. Oh, the guns feel good. Oh, I like their laser sights. Okay, so it looks like I can't shoot them when they're in cover. He's gonna pop up first. Nice. <laughs> you thought you could hide from me? I am your ape master. This is an emergency. Bravo okay, so I guess this is where it comes in handy having the ability to move with just one hand. And attacking. Orders are to kill on sight. Oh crap, out of ammo. Got some ammo. Alright, get to that next cover point. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> the bullet's kind of curved there. That was strange. Bravo unit. Bravo? Report in it. Is this thing broken? Someone, report in. I see you. I see you. You want a little piece of this? Don't mess with an ape with a gun. That's right. I'm a smart ape. safe here. No, I can't shoot you under. Tell you what, this is getting kind of intense. Okay, so jumping feels kind of cool. You know, like I said, I'm kind of liking this arm swing locomotion. I mean, I love free locomotion, but I mean, this is the next best thing, so. At least they didn't do teleport. Thank you, Fox. I mean, then again, I'm playing an ape, so it feels completely natural. There we go. Come on, fellas. Personnel must stand down and comply with evacuation orders. 
You must comply. The resistance is futile. The humans divided. Strong. Freedom? Where? Which way? Man, the 3D sound of that helicopter is freaking nuts. Love it. Uh-oh. Hey, now. Oh! Let's go. Run, eh? Be shooting. <laughs> oh shit! Mm, nice. <laughs> okay. Love me some good ragdoll glitches. So, okay, you know what? I think we're going to go ahead and cap the video here as, you know, I don't want to play too much of the game because I want you guys to experience this for yourself because, man, this is definitely something you need to experience for yourself. It is great. So if you want to try it, I am going to throw a link for this one down in the description. I highly, highly, highly recommend you grab this game. But for me, that's going to do it tonight. But before I go, I did want to make mention um, the new T-shirt. Love it. Got it sent to me by my good friend Michael Amerson. Uh, you guys may know him. He's the developer of Blackjack Bailey on the Gear VR. Uh, so if you want to grab a T-shirt like this as well, I am going to throw that link in the description too. But for me, that's it, guys. I'm out tonight. This is VR Gamer Dude signing off, y'all. Peace.